of course street speed's not up yet but uh you know i uh, i want to give him a little morning wake-up call <laughs> Hi, neighbor Rich here. Welcome to the channel. Today is going to be a great day and I know it and I hope you're having a fantastic day. Anyhow, spring is in the air. There's no question about it. The trees and stuff are starting to bud and uh, you can see that and the daffodils are coming up. It's kind of nice and you know it's not going to be long before we're going to be able to uh, start I think another season of some great car content. Um, as I look at my car, you know, I haven't had it out a whole lot this season at all. Uh, it has been a really kind of a mild winter here in the Northeast, which is really, really nice, but um, it hasn't been nice enough that I was gonna take out my little baby here. Um, I keep her uh, with her pajamas on and with a you know a battery tender most of the most of the winter for sure uh once they start putting down salt and they put down cinders and and little stones and stuff uh, i am really reluctant to uh, take it out because i did buy my car in the spring uh every year i have to take it back actually get it uh, inspected and I like them to take a look at it make sure everything looks good as we're coming up on the new season and i'm going to be driving it a good bit more so with that said you know let's uh take this cover off And here we go. Cover is off. And now we can get ready for that first cold start. Always love that. Here we go. getting ready to head over to uh, Whitmore to get this inspection stuff out of the way but uh, anyhow you know Pennsylvania is one of those states that uh, you know every year you got to get your car inspected and it seems kind of uh, you know over the top I really wish Pennsylvania would change it but you know how these states are man they just you know once they have something in place it's just like trying to pull teeth to uh, get them to change anything but uh, it's uh, only about 40 degrees here today so uh, at least this morning and of course street speeds not up yet but uh, you know I uh, want to give them a little morning wake-up call <laughs> There you go, buddy. Have a great day. We've officially made it. And, uh, you know, honestly, I only got to uh, rev bomb and blow by one Prius. Um, you know, I do consider that sport. Uh, heading into the service center. I got my favorite guys here. Mason, hey, hey Bill, how's it, hey, how's it going? Rich, how you doing, man? Good, good, good. Hey, you know what today is? Today is actually national compliment day so nice. i'm going to compliment you are a good looking guy Thank and you. you are extremely intelligent thanks sir how are Please you guys doing, doing great. awesome doing awesome i'm doing great thanks good, good. yep corvette out of winter storage i did get the corvette out of winter storage nice. and and actually in the beginning of this video i showed that where i um took the cover off took the charger off you know what i mean and i'm taking yeah. it out uh because i need to get it inspected and so red season it is it's coming up and i'm excited about it so we yep Anyhow, what I wanted to ask you, you know, uh, you know, I'm in PA and I know it and and all that, but you know, what do they actually do when they do an inspection? Yep. So you got to do it once a year. Right. And basically, they're checking anything that's safety related. So okay. brakes, tires, bulbs, suspension components, mm -hmm. just to make sure everything's safe for the road. That makes that makes a lot of sense. Yep. It, it really does. And you know, honestly, I mean, on newer cars, it probably doesn't make a whole lot of sense. But you know, on older cars, certainly, you know, you need to really make sure that you've got a vehicle yeah. that's safe for the road. So, Absolutely. as much as it's painful and I don't like it, 
uh, we'll uh, put up with it because, uh, you know, it, it's for the better good. Anytime I'm up here at Whitmore, I uh, always like to take a look at what they have in inventory at the moment, you know, and they actually have this uh, Rapid Blue 2021, really pretty. Uh, they're looking for 89.9 and uh, it's really nice looking. And then they've got a couple of Z06s. They've got this one, it's a 17. They're asking uh, 76.9. See what I can find out here on the listing. Uh, it's got 16,000 miles. I oh, know 6,000 miles. It's got 6,000 miles. It's a beautiful Z06. And then you've got this Z06 too. It's a 15 for $70,000. Uh, with a little stripe to it. I like those wheels. Um, although, you know, the Punisher wheels are really cool. But anytime you, you know, with the Z06s and those red calipers, I gotta love it, you know. But of course, this black one, uh, there's black with chrome. So you don't get to see those real often because a lot of times guys with the black, they just want to black them out and uh, come up with something else. But uh, this has got the uh, Z06 chrome wheels to it, uh, which of course is on mine as well. And then here's a black, this is a Grand Sport, but uh, here's a black Grand Sport. It's a 19 and uh, again, very pretty cars. So anyhow, I always like to kind of walk through those and take a look at what they've got up here and the kind of prices that they have for right now. So, Dean, yeah. I, I got to tell you, this this is your your dealership is awesome. Thank you so much. Thank you. You gotta sell me that 63 yeah. one of these days, okay? You gotta do it for me. It's the only old one I got. <laughs> <laughs> the only and, one I got. And, and I know you've got C8s, but I think your heart is really with the C7s. C7 is my favorite one. There yeah, you go. Absolutely. Just like I said, it's still the it's the old old Corvette look, style, sleek. Love the C8, the ride in the C8, but uh, yeah, I go to the C7. Yep. It's, it's my favorite to drive. Yep, yeah. yep, yep. I'm 100% with you. And you know what? Today on, on Neighbor Rich Channel, it's National Compliment Day. Oh. So you are an awesome hey, guy. Hey, thank you, buddy. You're thank welcome. You. Thanks for your business. Dude. Yeah, thank yeah, you. Yeah. <laughs> Take care. There you go. All right. You got it. All right, thanks. <laughs> well, that'll do it for this episode of Neighbor Rich. And as always, I really like to leave you with something positive. And the positive message for today is, you know, it is compliment day. I really hope that you compliment somebody because you know what, honestly, when you compliment people, you can just see they light up. So give somebody a little sunshine today and compliment them and have a wonderful day because you are awesome. More awesome than you think. Have a wonderful day. This is Neighbor Rich. I hope you enjoyed this upload. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up and uh, subscribe to the channel. We'll see you in the next one.